Other news here tonight. Upper Darby's mayor has now been charged with driving under the influence after a traffic stop last night in Upper Chichester. Charging documents allege that Barbara Ann Keffer failed a field sobriety test. Action News reporter Chad Pradelli joining us now, live now outside the Upper Darby Township building. Uh, Chad, police also think the mayor might have hit something before being pulled over last night? Yeah, hit a guardrail, Brian. Uh, Barbara Ann Keffer appeared drunk. She got in that accident, refused a blood test. Now the question is, will she remain in office as mayor? According to court records, Upper Darby Mayor Barbara Ann Keffer smashed into a guardrail in the 700 block of Meeting House Road, damaging the front end to her black Toyota Corolla and causing a flat. An officer spotted her afterwards as she was traveling on Route 322 near Chelsea Parkway. After he pulled her over, charging documents say she smelled of alcohol, had slurred speech, and bloodshot eyes. Keffer allegedly admitted to having three drinks and failed a roadside sobriety test and at one point refused to continue with that test. The officer placed her into custody and took her to the Upper Chichester Police Department, where she allegedly refused a blood test and also refused to be photographed and fingerprinted. She was charged with DUI and other related charges. The township released a statement on Mayor Keffer's behalf. It reads in part, Mayor Keffer and her family request privacy as they deal with the personal aspects of this incident, and she will offer additional comment in the near future. Pretty shocking news. Upper Darby resident and former Republican Councilman Patrick Spellman says the mayor could be forced to resign if council finds what's called moral turpitude, which is defined as an act that gravely violates the sentiment of accepted standard of the community. So far, current council members have refused to comment on any possible resignation. But 2nd District Republican Councilwoman Lisa Faraglia released a statement to Action News that reads, it is a sad thing that happened. I am happy to hear no one was hurt. I pray that she gets the help she needs. I mean, obviously due process plays a big part in this, but uh, there's an early indication show that there's just so much bad behavior involving this incident that she shouldn't be holding public office at this time. And sources tell me Mayor Keffer was returning from a Democratic fundraiser in Upper Chichester when she was pulled over. A preliminary hearing is scheduled for March 1st. Live in Upper Darby, Chad Prudelli, Channel 6, Action News. Brian? Chad, thank you.